IB Lite is a light version of Interbase that's embeddable in your mobile applications. It gives you full SQL 92 relational database support, all from the convenience of your mobile app. This mobile code snippet makes use of FireDAC to connect to the embedded IB Lite database. This all starts with the FD connection component. IB specifies Interbase, which is what we use to connect to IB Lite. This is pointing to the tasks GDB file, which is located on my C drive, which of course is not available from the mobile device. Then we have a table, which points to the fire task list connection and the task table in the database. And we have two queries here, one for insert and one for delete. You could do this all through the table if you wanted to, because FireDAC is a full bi-directional connection. But we're using a query here, and this query has a SQL statement, insert into task, which is the table name, and then the task name, which is the column, the value from that parameter. Inside the plus button here is the call to get the task name from the user, and then adds it as a parameter to the query statement and then executes the query statement and then refills the table. As I mentioned, the database won't be available on the mobile device because right now it's pointing to the C drive. But right here in the before connect event is some code that changes the value of the database parameter to the correct path. And so what it does here it uses this get documents path method to get the correct location, whether it be on Android or iOS, for the documents folder where this tasks.gdb file is stored. Now, in order to deploy the tasks.gdb file with our app, we have to go to the project deployment manager. And here's an entry for the tasks.gdb file and the remote path where it will be deployed to on the mobile app, which in this case on Android is .assets slash internal and then on iOS, it's startup slash documents. Also from here, you want to add the featured files to add support for Interbase to Go for iOS and Android. Both Interbase to Go and IB Lite use the same files because they're binary compatible. Interbase to Go adds additional functionality on top of IB Lite, like full in database encryption. You'll need to make sure you download your reg underscore ibelight.txt file and place it in the Interbase redistribution folder so that your license can be deployed with your application. This app runs the same on both iOS and Android, so let's take a look at it running on my Samsung Note 3. Here's the app running. You'll see it has two records in the database from the previous time I ran it, and that's because these records persist between sessions running the application because they're saved locally. I'm going to go ahead and add a new set record. Test. And there's our new test record, which I can select, and then tap delete to delete it. To see this mobile code snippet and more, visit embarcadero.com slash snippets.